Like very few artists, Paul McCartney can claim an enviable catalog of songs. With the Beatles, with Wings, in his alternative projects, and as a solo artist. And even so, with all that he's composed, there have been some songs that have generated a certain professional zeal, admiration, or however you want to say it. Today, we present five songs by other artists that Paul McCartney wished he had written. It was the mid-60s. The Beatles were in friendly competition with the Beach Boys to achieve the perfect album. Or, well, they were trying to. And from those years until today, Paul has been clear that God Only Knows is probably his favorite song, describing it as the perfect song. He eventually came out with this God Only Knows. That was Pet Sounds time, right? On, on Pet Sounds, mm. yeah. I just think it's a great song, melody, harmonies, words. It's a great song, I love it, you know, it's just one of my, it's, it's my favorite Beach Boy song. No other artist's song has ever been mentioned as much by Paul as this one. Paul said, God Only Knows is one of the few songs that makes me cry every time I hear it. It's really just a love song, but it's brilliantly done. It shows Brian's genius. McCartney inducted Brian Wilson into the Songwriters Hall of Fame, once again showing his admiration for Brian. And as an iconic event, they performed it together at a gala in 2002. A few years ago, during a conversation at Liverpool Institute for Performing Arts, the former Beatle was asked what song by another songwriter he would have liked to have written, to which Paul replied, There's always a couple that I hear that I think I'd have liked to have written. I liked Sting's Fields of Gold, and I thought, I should have written that. How dare he? I told him, you stole my song. I thought that was a nice one, you know? After hearing this, Sting wrote on his Twitter, Paul McCartney says he wishes he would have written Fields of Gold. There are more than a few of Paul's that I wish I would have written. To hear this from someone I owe my life to is very special. Thank you, Paul. In 2013 on Twitter, in an interaction with fans, Paul was asked about the songs he would have liked to write. Paul mentioned again, Fields of Gold by Sting, besides mentioning the classic, My One and Only Love. The 1953 song has been covered by many artists such as Frank Sinatra and John Coltrane. It became a jazz staple, and Paul himself covered it in 2012 for his album, Kisses on the Bottom. My one and only love. During the 80s, the murder of John Lennon was still very recent, and it was only months after his death when Paul did a special with the BBC in 1982. He talked about some songs, and it was there where he talked about his friend's song. And when he listened to it, he was on the verge of tears. Years later, when he was preparing his movie, Broad Street, he wanted to record a cover for the soundtrack. He really loved the song, but it was never known why he didn't do it anymore. That's all for today. We invite you to like the video and subscribe. This is Music Box.